EFCO brings you EFCO Deck. The system is a handset shoring and reshoring system for elevated concrete slab construction. It is an excellent product for floor to ceiling heights of 7 to 15 feet and slabs up to 12 inches thick and can deliver wider than normal shore post spacing. The EFCO Deck system complements EFCO's Easy Deck system and Adjust a Deck system. EFCO's Easy Deck system is used primarily for the higher floor to ceiling heights, thicker slabs, and most important, assembling the system on the ground and assembled movements between pours. The best applications for EFCO's Adjust a Deck system are when the columns and walls of a building are located and available to support the concrete forming platform. The system is also valuable where repetitive large decks are to be formed, where crane time is available, and when large deck panels can be handled outside the building without interfering with the adjacent structures, traffic, and ground traffic patterns. EFCO is dedicated to providing you the best value and lowest in-place concrete costs. With over 72 years of innovations and inventions for concrete forming systems, EFCO has done it again with EFCO Deck. And now, EFCO's series of training videos will provide you with detailed demonstrations of the best methods for assembling and cycling your EFCO Deck system. This step-by-step -step video will focus on reducing labor costs and increase safety on your project again providing you with the best value and lowest in-place concrete costs on your shoring and decking project. EFCO Deck has just a few parts which can be quickly assembled to construct high production shoring and decking. This system can be used with Easy Deck when a project requires a floor height over 15 feet. Aluminum primary beams, along with high-strength galvanized steel posts and secondary beams, result in lightweight, long-lasting equipment. This system is versatile, easy to assemble, and quick to cycle. EFCO Deck does not require cranes or fork trucks to assemble or strip the equipment. A crane or material hoist is needed to move racks of posts and beams from floor to floor. Cranes for conventional flying truss systems are generally much larger and more expensive. The versatility of the EFCO deck also makes it easy to form variations and complex floor layouts with ease. Sometimes adjoining structures and ground level traffic patterns also can limit the movement of large flying deck systems. The EFCO deck shoring posts can also be used as a reshore, which can reduce reshore labor. The forming and shoring engineering specialists at EFCO, along with EFCO field representatives dedicated to project productivity, have developed a step-by-step -step process for the EFCO deck system's assembly and cycling procedures. These procedures will deliver the benefits of the system and give you the opportunity to operate in less time and with less effort. This will help you maintain your production schedules, saving you money, while the assembly requirements of your project may differ from the examples used here, at EFCO, we keep safety and productivity in mind as our engineers and field service representatives help you design the best assembly method for your project. This step-by-step -step presentation will feature initial installation and cycling procedures for the EFCO deck. Planning the work and working the plan is the key to success. Good engineering support for your project is, of course, a requirement. When presented with clear analysis and specifications, our engineers can help your team to set up leg spacing, lateral bracing, and specifications for the project. EFCO's field service support and engineering guidance will assist you in selecting the best methods for the safest and most efficient assembly and cycling of your forming system. As with all forming and shoring equipment, safety is everybody's job. You must observe and follow all safety guidelines and applicable codes at all times. Determining concrete strength is critical prior to stripping the formwork and then also prior to loading the slab with shoring and formwork to support the next slab above. The EFCO deck system permits early removal of forming materials while shore posts remain in place. It is the contractor's responsibility, relying on job site engineering personnel,
to assure that the concrete strength is sufficient to resist forces at all steps in the forming process. This includes supports under the slab shoring system, as well as the reshoring of previously poured slabs. Those things we focus on, we are successful at, and those things we ignore, we can fail. Think safety and work safely.